Chris, do you want to go ahead and jump right in with the cadet's personal log? Cadet's personal log, star date 2510.6. My assignment to Enterprise is over. After we complete our current mission, delivering vidium power cells to Deep Space Station K7, I go back to Earth. I'm excited to see my grandmother. Our last call was cut short. Life on a starship has a way of taking over. I rotated through almost every department. So many amazing, talented people. The top everyone of everything. They all know why they belong in Starfleet. For them, Starfleet has always been the destination. For me, it was where I ran after the loss of my parents. Serving aboard Enterprise is an affirmation of this entire crew's hopes and dreams. I envy their surety. But me? I guess I'm still searching. Yeah. So, it sounds like Uhura is going to bail out, and that's where we're headed there. You're right. When they do things with her like this, it, it's hard to keep out of mind that we then watch her for the next 40 years, you know? Yeah. It, like, it's so annoying that they do that. I mean, to be fair, maybe she gets assigned to something else before coming back to oh, the sure. Enterprise. So, uh, that's fair. That's fair. So... I take this better than like when you put her in a life and death situation. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cause I mean, there's seven years till Kirk takes over. So she can totally go serve on a different ship. And plus, like I have heard through the Facebook grapevine lately that basically people assume that this takes place in an alternate universe, <sighs> which I don't necessarily agree with that. But, um, it does. I assume when this season is over, we will have a long conversation about all of that. <laughs> yeah, it, it doesn't. But yeah, you know what? I think that's like the next episode we should actually do when we're done, you know? Yeah. Is its place, you know? Yeah. Agreed. That is a pet peeve I have that just every time I see that come up or when I see somebody reference how J.J. Abrams and Discovery, who has nothing to do with it. But, you know, we'll save all that. <laughs> we'll come back to it. Yeah. J.J. Uh, Abrams is the alternate timeline. This is... This is the prime. Prime, yeah. Yeah. 